54 million Americans have arthritis. That includes 1.6 million adults and 6,000 children here in Tennessee. Arthritis is the leading cause of disability in our country, and there is no cure. So joining me now to talk about a fun way to raise money in the search for that cure are Dr. Brett Smith from Children's Hospital and Lauren McAllister, a top fundraiser for the Arthritis Foundation. Good to see you both. Nice to uh, let's first talk about, Dr., uh, how more children than people realize have arthritis. So as parents, what do we need to be looking for with some common signs and symptoms? Sure. Common complaints in kids are growing pains, leg pain, arm pain sometimes. But a lot of kids have different symptoms with arthritis. Joints can swell bigger than they would be accustomed to in a small child. Mm -hmm. Ankles, toes, knees, fingers sometimes. Many children will limp. And so kids really don't fake limps, and so that usually needs to be evaluated by a physician typically. That's a really important sign, isn't it? Yeah, limping's it? very important. Okay. Asking to be carried more typically than they would be accustomed to. Not every child reports pain, so anything that seems atypical in terms of limping or asking to be carried more or swelling probably needs to be evaluated. It's fairly common, about 100, 1 in 200 in every 50 kids. Wow, and, and you treat some really young kids too. What's the youngest? Uh, as young as 12 months, we've diagnosed with juvenile arthritis. Wow. Wow. All right. And some kids can grow out of it? Some kids can grow out of thing? it. Yeah. Unfortunately for some kids, it can be lifetime, and that's why there's appropriate treatment in physicians, but mm -hmm. many children do require treatment regardless of uh, the type of treatment, whether it be pills, liquid injections, those mm -hmm. kind of things. But in order for kids to grow out of it, they do need appropriate evaluation and treatment sure. by a rheumatologist. Yeah, as early as possible. So yes. here is where we go to find a cure. Lauren, tell us why you support the Arthritis Foundation. I support the Arthritis Foundation in honor of my sister. My little sister was diagnosed with juvenile arthritis when she was just 13. Mm -hmm. And that was after three years of symptoms like Dr. Smith was talking wow. about. She um, woke up one morning and her fingers were stiff and she couldn't tie her shoes. And as a 10-year-old, that was unusual. And mm -hmm. a couple days later, she couldn't climb the stairs to her bedroom and then she couldn't turn on the shower and and that's where it started with her and then she started spiking fevers randomly and from there it sent us on a hunt to to find an answer and figure out why she wasn't herself and was in pain and didn't feel well and and had to you know quit things she loved she was a competitive gymnast mm -hmm. and and had to quit that sport because her body just couldn't handle it anymore just a whole range of things yes. affecting the entire family and, and the person right. who has it so quickly we're almost out of time but uh, what do we need to do to take part in a fun event coming up December 8th it's the Jingle Bell Run and you're still uh, collecting teams and folks yes, signing we up are. so what do you need to do? It is a highlight of the holiday season for yeah. a lot of people. You can join at the on our website, which is jbr.org for okay. Jingle Bell Run. And out there, we gather together. We uh, get decked out, wear Santa hats, you get jingle bells to tie to your shoes, some teams will have <laughs> costumes, and um, there's a 5K, a one mile, and then a kids run as well, and all sorts of activities uh, beginning before that and then after our award ceremony as well. Wonderful. All right, December 8th, that's on a Saturday at World's Fair Park. Mm -hmm. So excited. I'm honored to MC. I'm talking Bo and maybe some other folks into maybe running. Bo? We're running. Oh, there right. we go. Yeah. So I'm like, there we go. <laughs> I love it. Thanks, you all, for, for being with us and for everything you're doing sure. of course. to help Thank with you. this. All right. We're looking forward.